Hi, this is Robert from socialmediaseo.net. Today I am going to show you how to add the static FBML app to your Facebook fan page. All right, let's get started. First thing I'm going to do is search static FBML. And right there it is at the top. Go ahead and click that. And then right here underneath the image is add to my page. Go ahead and click the add to my page link. And now what we're going to do is scroll through until you find your specific page that you want to add it to. And right here is my page. So I'm going to click add to page and then go ahead and click close. All right. Now I'm going to go ahead and head back over to my Facebook fan page where I just added the FBML app. And then right here underneath the image, what you want to do is click edit page. And now we are on the management dashboard for your Facebook fan page. So I'm going to scroll through until I find the static FBML app. And that's it right there. It says Twitter. That's because I had some previous Twitter code. Um, if you're installing it for the first time, you'll see static FBML or just FBML. But that is the image right there that it looks like. So um, once you find it, all you want to do is click edit. And now right here we come to the FBML um, text editor. So um, this is the old code that was in there. So I'm going to remove that. This is what it will look like when you first come to it. And you have a title and you have an FBML box. This is where you actually put your HTML code. I'm going to add a, um, a default landing tab to um, help people who are non-fans become a fan of my Facebook fan page. So the first thing I'm going to do is name the title and I'm going to call it join because I want people to join my Facebook fan page. And whatever you put there is what is going to show up on the tabs of your Facebook fan page and we'll see that in a second. Um, next I'm going to grab the code and this is just the code that I pre-made. Um, it's very customizable. Uh, you can pretty much add any basic um, HTML code here to your FBML app. So you got the tab name and you got your code. Then you'll just come down here to the bottom and hit save changes. And you get the message that changes have been saved. All right. So next I'm going to go ahead and head back to my Facebook fan page. And again, I'm going to click edit page so that it takes me back to the dashboard. And right here is my FBML app called joined. Next, what I want to do is I want to specify this app to be right up here on one of these tabs. So what I'm going to do is come back to the app. And this time, instead of clicking edit, I'm going to click application settings and this box here is going to open. Um, you notice right now it's set for boxes is added and tab is available. Tab is actually the tabs at the top of the fan page so I want to add that and I want to remove box and click OK. Now I come back to my Facebook fan page and this time I'm just going to go ahead and hit F5 and just do a hard refresh and then you'll notice right here is join and that is my custom FBML app that I just made. Go ahead and click on that. And right there is the image with the text. Next, what I want to do very quickly is I want to specify people to land on that tab who are not fans. This time I'm going to come over here to my wall settings. Right here, default landing tab for everyone else. I'm going to go ahead and click join. And it just automatically saves. And that's it. So now anytime who anytime somebody who is a non fan comes and visits my Facebook fan page, they will land right here on this join tab. And since they're not fans, that button that says become a fan will be right here. And that arrow points up and it will encourage them to become a fan. And that's it. Thank you.